and welcome to another video in today's video it's all about my bike so i had this pretty much custom built after i broke a similar bike similar frame which i had had since like the mid 90s which was a schwinn shark cruiser so i broke that shark cruiser like down there and then i bought this had it all hooked up and this is a uh, like a mountain bike rim with a wall riding tire with a coaster brake and then there's a pair of hubs here or a pair of uh, different forks on there different headset so I broke this bike in the same spot bought a welder and fixed it broke it up here welded it fixed it so what just happened is this broke right? so i went to the shop they didn't have another one so i'm just going to drill that now what i got going on here is i've had this bike i've had for probably about 12 years or something at this point it's my favorite thing to do like i just really enjoy riding it certain circumstances i like riding around rivers they had a really nice spot in portland or they do have a really nice spot in portland to ride like that and bend has one it's really short but it's very nice no cars so <clears throat> my t-shirt is always right here i got a speaker that goes there i got a water bottle that goes there my t-shirt and I like my glasses go under here and then my phone is just like hanging in my pocket right so what I'm going to do, and then that's falling back, is I need to, I'm going to replace these screws with some nice Allen style ones so I can actually, because that's what I have my tools in here is an Allen wrench. I don't know what happened, how I ended up with those, but so I'm going to swap those out. I'm going to fix this here, and then I'm going to put a Milwaukee pack out right here. The new little single plate model and a little compact one and I'm gonna get new lights because I had these lights I think these are discontinued lights so and they're just really old and I lost them for the front and I haven't been able to find like a little mounting light so I gotta find new little mounting lights it's gonna have lights every once in a while I actually haven't used lights in a long time so all right, so stay tuned and watch how I put this Milwaukee pack out on there. All right, I am in the process of, I finally got the Milwaukee pack out stuff in the mail that I want to hook on my bike. Yeah, it's going to be interesting here how this all works out. All right, here is my solution. So I had to put a couple new holes in my rack, but two carriage bolts extra washers and nylock all right let's see what it looks like on there oh yeah actually it looks better than i thought it was for a while i was going to put it on the front just because i i really like the look of the bike without anything back there it just looked freaking cool but the more I freaking delve into trying to put all that up there, and when this got here, and this piece was as big, look how much it sticks out. I didn't realize it was so big, right? But it looks just sick on the back, as far as I'm concerned. Like, I was able to get this, this uh, a little tighter to give it that, like, angle that it kind of has, like, a, a little little swoosh to it that just looks good all right a little red accent it's mostly black so it kind of disappears but yeah i mean the whole point of this is my phone i have my phone on this uh tripod all the time and it just generally hangs out of my pocket and I've had one problem and I actually broke the little tripod thing had to put some glue on it and fix it so $1,200 phone just hanging out of my pocket 
literally just like because the I'll take a shot of it here to show you but it's definitely this is going to be much better now I don't I can put whatever back there and not worry about it